friends, welcome in. I'm Katie, this is your cardio hit. Go ahead, clear some space, get some water on standby. Today you're just gonna need a mat and make sure your shoes are laced up nice and tight. With that, let's get rolling right into those jumping jacks. Up and out, let's go. Feel lots of modifications today. First one right here, if you need to take out that jump, take out any impact, you're gonna tap this out right here. Check in, abs are in nice and tight to support your spine. Shoulders are back and down. Bend in those elbows. Toes forward. Today, I have a familiar format for you. Two big blocks of work. We work for two minutes at a time. I give you 30 seconds back. We repeat, we repeat, we repeat, we move on. And then at the end, we're gonna top this thing off with a four minute AMRAP with some brand new fresh moves, which will be the first and only time you see those moves today. So, once we are done with our two big blocks in front of us, you're done. You are truly done. Those moves will not come back to haunt you later. <laughs> and I actually promise and I actually mean that. Circle back for me, heating up those shoulders. Please slow anything down today that you want or need to. And remember, switch things up. Do what works for you today. Remember that this is your time. So, make it count. It's in the best way. Arms across your chest, open and close. Good, give me a deep inhale, scoop those arms up. Exhale, we're gonna sink down into a squat. Feet just outside your hips, knees forward, booty down and back. Exhale, stand it up with a little calf raise down. And up. Good, from the side, my chest is lifted. My booty is down and back, my shoulders are down. Perfect, awareness in your core, squeeze those glutes. Perfect, we're gonna take this to a sumo. So feet out wide, toes are turned out, we drop in. Back up into that calf, calf raise, sumo, calf raise. Break this up if you need to, if you wanna make it two moves. That works too, or if you wanna wrap it, flow it all together, that works as well. Drop your shoulders, drop your hips straight underneath you if you can, like you are sliding your back down the wall. Good. All right, let's get those hips a little bit more. Find your balance on one foot, make sure you're not gonna kick anything. Opposite legs, swing front and back. Chest stays up, so when you kick back, I don't want you to lean forward. I just want you to stay up nice and right so we can open up that hip. Switch side. Find your balance, lock it in. Find something not moving to focus on. Don't focus on me. <laughs> I will move, I could fall. If I do, you're probably gonna come with me and we don't need that, right? <laughs> All right, side to side a little bit. Feet out nice and wide, plant your whole foot flat into the floor. Side to side lunge. Booty down and back, we wanna line up that knee. It's the middle of the foot, just like our squat. So after this, we're gonna jump right into our first block of work. Again, it's four moves, three times through. It will fly by, I promise. In the moment, it might not feel like that. But <laughs> again, it's only 30 minutes together today, so make it count. Enjoy the moment. <laughs> moment. All right, shake that out for me. Quick sip of water if you need it. First time through, I just want you to mark through it with me. If you get the move right away, jump in, go all out, absolutely. But if you need to, I want you to save those all out efforts for the second and third round, okay? So that's gonna be your time to shine. We'll add a little razzle dazzle at the end of the block <laughs> and then we'll move on. Okay, a little bit of agility, a little bit to make you think today. Slap, back, jack. So the foundation, Feet are in a jumping jack, out and in. Join me here. You know the deal, modified, just like in our warm up. you're gonna tap. Now, arms are strong, you're gonna fire up your triceps here. When you step out, your arms are gonna squeeze back behind you. All out, we're here. So arms are super straight. I want you to think kind of like your arms are moving through water, so you're creating a lot of your own resistance here. Best thing about this move, if you really want to speed it up, you can. Shoulders back and down, same thing modified. Speed it up if you want, but I want you to stay a little bit lower. Good, deep breath in, long breath out. Next move is a reaction drill. We're gonna start in a sprint. Get your arms moving, run, go. If you're like, hi, I don't run, you're gonna jog, or it's a power walk. Okay, then we go into a full jumping jack. When I say jack, modified, you're here. Sprint, jack, 
You gotta wait for me though, that's what makes it fun. Sprint! All out every time, go. Didn't say it. <laughs> Jack. Awesome dad friends, from here. A little bit of side to side. We're gonna slide, bend your knees, slide, pop it up, shoot. Slide, pop it up, shoot. Perfect. So we're low to high, just like our burpees, right? Any type of level change is gonna shoot that heart rate up. No jump, you slide, you calf raise and reach. Slide, calf raise and reach. Cool? You pick your pace. Nice, okay. Last mover head to the floor. One of my favorites. Twist a mountain climber. So hands are on the floor or they can be on a chair. Right knee to left elbow. Step back, left to right. Step back, belly button in. If this doesn't work for you, you're just gonna hold that plank on your knees or on your toes, all right? Breathe, you can also pick up your pace if you can keep your hips low. Keep everything in line with your back. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Knees down, give me a quick stretch. Woo! Those are your four moves. So hopefully, you're ready to take it up a notch with me. Cause now you know it's coming. We're ready for it. <laughs> Woo! All right. The goal here, we're working for two entire minutes. I want you to get to the point where you have to modify. That's where the high intensity part comes in, right? Flat back, Jack, squeeze through those arms, let's go. So again, I know a lot of our names for moves are very long, but they kind of help you figure out exactly what we're doing. Arms, flat back, feet, have that jumping jack part. Good, get your shoulders down, go, go. We're going for speed and power this round. All right, form first but then speed and power. Sprint, go. Again, maybe it's a walk or a march in place, that's cool. Jack, but you go on my call, you turn on that brain, you fire everything up, all right? Sprint, Jack, Sprint. Got it. Jack, Sprint, Jack, Sprint. Jack, good dog, guys. Slide and shoot. To the right, pop it up. To the left, pop it up. Okay, keep going. When I slide, I'm bringing my feet all the way together. I take it to that hop or to that calf raise. My knees and toes stay forward. Come on. Bring your arms with you. Give them a job, give them a purpose. <laughs> Abs in tight. Soft landing. Take it to the floor, twist and mountain. Hands under those shoulders, let's go, twist. Slow your breathing, I know it's tough. Everything on purpose, modify, we step or we hold. Come on, you should be breathless, you have a recovery coming up. Good, touch that chin, stay with me. Stay with me. Four, three, two, one, relax, recover, stretch. We do that one more time. Mom caught me at the end. Woo. <laughs> Check in. Quick inventory, how are you doing? Are you breathless? Are you super uncomfortable? Good. That's why we do HIIT training, because it doesn't last forever. But that fat burn that we get, <laughs> that lasts a lot longer than 30 minutes. Slap back, Jack, let's go. So, and you know that, right? One of the most efficient ways that we can train is with that high intensity interval training. And we don't train like this every day. We shouldn't train like this every day. So use this time to step it up a notch. Come on. You're like, thank goodness, right? <laughs> Reaction Joe coming up, get ready. Rip. Go, 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 go. Arms are gonna pump, your legs are gonna go faster for it, Jack. Good, breathe. Don't lose that intensity. Sprint. Drop those shoulders, come on. Jack. Sprint. Jack. Sprint. <laughs> Woo! Jack. Abs in. Get low. Let's go. Slide and shoot. 
Squeeze those feet together. Slide, shoot, good. Again, modify, stay low, jump high. Reach high. Good, maybe get a little lower in those legs. Fire up those quads, fire up those glutes. Take up a little more space. Five seconds. Okay, deep breath. Head to the floor, twisted mountain climber. Find your perfect alignment and then go for it. Look straight down at the floor for me. Right in between those index fingers, come on. Good, imagine you're driving that knee to your armpit. Are you breathing? Please try it. Okay, power move. You're not gonna like it. You're probably gonna say mean things to me in your head, it's cool. Bring it up. 180 turn, you step or you jump. You do a burpee. Take it down and back, in and up. Five. Step or jump, burpee. 180 turn, burpee. 180 turn, burpee. Keep going, so modified. Again, it's a half turn. Step to plank, a step to squat, and a reach. You have 20 seconds. Almost a minute to recover after this. Come on. Line them up. So my knee's here. Straight ahead. Straight ahead. You got five, four. Come on for three, two, one. You're done. Awesome job, friends. Okay, remember right here, that feeling? This is like your fire breathing dragon feeling. Yeah, <laughs> that's how you know you did it right. Yeah, if we're not there today, cool. Maybe that's not what today's about for you, and that's fine. It's actually great. <laughs> just move. We're just moving, that's our number one goal, right? All that other stuff is bonus. Okay, I would love to tell you that, hey, we're gonna slow down a little bit in this next block. We're not. So if you need to slow down, you take the modification so you keep your feet moving though. Cool? Okay, cool. Four new moves. Walk through it with me. Oh no. Yep, you know what happened. Switch kick punch. Come with me. So we have opposite arm, opposite leg here. I'm punching my left arm, kicking my right. Right, left. Right, left. Cool, if that doesn't work for you, you can march. If you need more, you're gonna hop it out. Good. Okay, trick here. Try not to lean away from your leg. Keep the shoulders right on top of the hip. You're gonna work your core a little bit harder there. Okay, back to the floor. Alternating plank lunge ankle tap. I know, it's a lot of words, but you're gonna know exactly what we're doing. Meet me in a high plank. Nice wide low lunge with your right foot. Your left foot's gonna tap in at the ankle. Step back to plank and switch. Lunge left, tap the ankles together, back to plank. From the side, low lunge, tap, plank, other side. Low lunge, tap, do your best on that one. Just watch your knees, make sure you're shifting your weight back. Back to standing, sumo, meet me there. We did these in the warm up, right? Sumo, this time we have a little pulse or a hop up to you. Knees toward the middle of your foot, then, we're gonna climb a rope. Pull it down, pull it down, pull it down. Abs are in, pull a little bit harder. Modified, you keep that pull. Pull, toes forward, let's finish this one out. It's a squat jump. Down, power up away from the floor. Heart pounding, we are panting, but we're good. Modify, squat calf raise. Again, kind of an extension of that warm up. From the side, my chest is up. My booty is always lower than my shoulders. What do I mean? I'm not here. I'm dropping into the hips. I'm using the strongest muscles in my body. Through those legs. Whew. Okay. Wow, quad. All right. Breathe. <laughs> That's a lot of just what our lower body does for us, too. We kick those legs in, heart rate comes up a little bit higher. You ready to go for it? Switch kick, punch. Coming at ya. 
Those four moves. Two more times. A lot of movement here. Double check your space. Make sure you're not going to trip over anything. Abs in, shoulders down. Find the movement. Now pick it up. Let's go. Again, you can kick. You can take a low kick. You can take a high knee. You can march. You can run. I don't care, but everybody shift forward just a touch. Get those shoulders on top of your hips. Go. Go, go, go. Can you get those feet a little higher? <laughs> Abs in, don't forget about them. Awesome, okay. Meet me on the floor in your high plank. Low lunge, tap that back foot in to plank. Lunge, tap, plank, switch. Lunge, tap, plank, switch. You wanna just hold that plank, turn your brain off, do it. That works. Maybe you make it a little smaller. That's cool. This is a great place to go. Kind of a nice middle ground. Slowly bring it up. Head comes up last so you don't get dizzy. Sumo. Pull that rope. Let's go. Again, use your imagination on this one. You're pulling that rope down. It weighs a million pounds. Let's go. Pull. Yes, a million. <laughs> Modified. You are still in the work. You're just taking off the bounce. Come on. Get that chest up. Drop your booty a little lower. Four, three, two, one. Feet, knees are parallel. Squat jump, go. Again, modification. You just get rid of that jump. At the bottom, hold it. Where are your knees? They're not here. They're not caving in. We're pushing them out, line them with the middle of your foot. Get back in it. Good. Chest up, chest up. Abs in tight, squeeze. Exhale, reach. You got four, three, two, one. Shake out those legs. Woo. Home stretch team. We do those moves one more time. We add on a little core cardio finisher. We got our AMRAP and we're out of here. Woo. Use this time to breathe. Keep your feet moving for me and keep your chest up. Switch kick. Add that punch. Let's pick it up. Go, 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 go. Last time you do these moves today. Good, get those legs up. <laughs> that was me 100% talking to myself. <laughs> if it applies for you too, come on. Join me. Again, right here works. Right here works. Keep it low, that works. You get the idea, come on. Five seconds. Four. Plank, lunge, tap, take it back. If you're ready to add some speed, do it. But I need you to get that butt a little bit lower. We're not sinking into the hips, but we're not up in a down dog or anything close to it. Keep that booty right behind you. Good, press those hands into the floor, come on. Sumo coming up, not yet. Three, two, one. Roll it up. Let's go. Find that sumo squat, get low. Now pull, pull, pull. Modify, you're right here. Here's your core itch on purpose. You're activated, you're ready. <laughs> Pull harder. Good, come on. Maybe a bigger range of motion. Let's go. Woo. Exhale every time that rope pulls down. Down. Woo. Toes forward, booty back. Find that squat jump. Jumping right now. Might feel. <laughs> like your legs weigh a million pounds, but use those arms, propel yourself up. Know that you only have a couple more seconds here. Tap raise if you need to. Keep your form. Five seconds. We head back down to the floor. Woo. On those hands, find your high plank. Everybody start on your knees with me. Get your hands under your shoulders. We lower down, forearm plank, back up to high plank. Then you're gonna take four traditional mountain climbers, knee straight through to the middle of your chest. All right, so if you're on your toes, down, down, up, up, run it out, four, three, two, one. Whole thing on your knees. You're gonna hold, maybe take a little kneeling knee to elbow. All right, down, down, up, up, four mountain climbers. 
You have 30 seconds to go. Bring your booty with you wherever you go. Don't leave it up in the air. Woo. Good, if you haven't tried one on your toes, try it. Awesome job, team. Woo! Okay, two of two. Power sections. I think I call that your razzle-dazzle. <laughs> so sorry, I'm the way I am. All right, team, shake it out. Grab a quick sip of water. Fix your hair. If you have the world's loosest ponytail like I do today. <laughs> okay, four moves. We do all of them for four reps and you just keep going. First time through, join me. We have four push-ups On your knees or toes, hands just outside your shoulders. Let's go. It's four, three, two, and one. From here, you're gonna step or jump your feet into catchers. Down and back. Step or jump. You stay in the squat. Are you waiting to catch? Yes? Catch that ball. Okay. From there, we have rolling elbow planks. So, we come back down to those forearms. You open up to the side, four. Other side is three. Modify on your knees, two, and one. Then, you're carefully gonna come up to standing. Head comes up last, we have a rocket slam. So imagine you have that medicine ball in your hand. Reach it up, slam it down. Option to cap raise, option to jump. You're only doing four of them, then you go back to the top. Let's go, four push-ups. Woo, this song is just under four minutes. You have four push-ups, four catchers. Bam, bam, modify, you step it. Hands can also come back to that chair. Good, hold your last one down. Rolling forearm side plank. Whole thing can be on your knees. Switching to one side is one. The next side is two, three, four. Stand it up, rock it, slam. I don't slam it. Slam it, like way too dramatic. Do it. Four push-ups, four catchers, four side planks, four rocket slams. Come on. Form is more important than speed, okay? Remember that. Catchers. It's like the bottom half of that burpee, but your legs get the bonus work. Hold that last one down. To your elbows. Woo, you got this. <laughs> I hope this song's stuck in your head all day. It's a fun one. <laughs> Four rocket slams. Get up and down however you need to. It doesn't have to be pretty. Arm stretch, come on. You try to get one more in. Four push-ups. <laughs> Catch her. <laughs> Hold that last one down. Rolling side planks. Woo. You want to challenge for those side planks? Lift that top leg. Yeah. This is the best part. <laughs> Rock and slam. Where are you? How are you? How many more you got in you? One more round? Two more rounds? Sounds almost over. Woo! Stay in it, stay with me. Even if you're stepping, even if you're marching it out, even if you're doing something completely different, do something. Awesome job, team. Four minutes every day. Rack and slam. How many more you got? When you're done, you're done. You do not have to finish whatever round you're on. Woo. Get that belly button in. Come on, team. Please stay with me. Guys, that's it. Wherever you are, meet me back in that high plank. You're going to scale down to the knees, head back to that child's pose. Congratulations. You made it to your cool down. Friends, I'll be really honest. Today was no joke. <laughs> Ooh, it'll take a little bit for your heart rate to come down. It should. From here, we're gonna stretch out the shoulders. I just want you to take that left arm, thread it under your right, and then look at it. 
Good. So we're pressing that left shoulder into the floor. Good, go ahead, switch it. Left arm reaches forward, right arm scoops under the left. Head can turn and look at the right. Right hand. Reach it back to the center. And carefully roll it up. Woo. All right, when you're ready, left foot steps forward. Squeeze your booty, shift your hips forward, open up that hip flexor. Arms are gonna inhale, reach up, look between them. Exhale, shift your weight back, flex that front foot. Do that again, inhale, reach up, press the hips forward. Exhale, shift your booty back, reach for the floor. One more of those. All right, take that leg, sweep it to the side, and then shift your weight back. Get your left pinky toe on the floor for me. Perfect. All right, coming up, let's do all that on the other side. Right foot's gonna step forward. Square off the hips, inhale, shift your weight forward, look up between those hands. Exhale, shift your weight back. My toes are untucked here. Feel free to do whatever you need to with that back foot. Ooh. Good, exhale, hold this last one back. Awesome. Right leg, sweep it directly to your side, right in line with that hip. Now, rotate at that ankle, get the pinky toe on the floor. Perfect, shift your weight back. Same thing here, my toes are untucked. Feel free to keep them tucked if that feels better for you. Relax your shoulders, relax everything through that upper body. And then we're gonna come on up to standing. Bend that knee, bring it up. Find a high lunge for me. So right now my left leg is forward. Do whatever you need to do. I know it's confusing. <laughs> if you're trying to do exactly what I'm doing. So for now you can do as I say. Left leg forward, drop in, shoulders back and down, right arm sweeps across your chest for a shoulder stretch. So right now it's gonna look backwards, don't worry about it. You got it. Good, pull the back foot in, drop the heel down to stretch out your calf, and then we're gonna take this arm, transition it to a tricep stretch. So that hand is reaching down your back, perfect. Opposite hand is pressing on the elbow. Beautiful, let's switch. The right leg forward, left leg back. Good, square hips. Again, do as I say, don't worry about it. <laughs> Same side arm as the leg that is back. Take it across your chest for a shoulder stretch. Beautiful. Now scoot that back foot in, plant the heel down. Try that. Awesome, a lot of things work today. <laughs> Perfect, step it in, let's open up that chest. Inhale, tuck your booty under. Good, now drop your head to one side. Relax your shoulders, relax your face. Put your head up and over other side. Good. Relax your forehead. Nice, bring it to the center. Let's inhale those arms up. Interlace the fingers up top. Give me an exhale as you lengthen up and over to one side. Good, reach a little bit deeper. Inhale, exhale, switch up and over. Nice. Inhale back to the center. Long, long exhale, let it go. You are done. Awesome job, team. Thank you so much for being here. I will catch you next time.